Okay, people have asked me uh, details about this um, disconnecting the wiring underneath. So on the gray one, yes, uh, it's connected here, but you push this button, it comes apart. Okay, I see. So this has to be, this has to be disconnected from this gray holder. Um, I'm not sure how to do it. Let me have a look at it. Hang on. Okay, so this, 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 uh, this, uh, you can see the connector, the way it looks on the back. That's just a stop. This is a rail that it slides on. So you can actually pull it up and push it out like that. Hopefully you can see that. And to put it back on, you just put it on the top. There it is. Okay, so that should work. This one here, I'm not, we're not going to take this one off, but I'm just, I took it off just to check it out. Yep, there it is, it's in. Take it off, you just lift it up, lift it towards you. Um, I'm going to pause this, and then we'll cover the black one. Okay, and the black one, I think it's easier if you pull it out of the holder assembly. The way I did it is, I just pushed these tabs on the outside. Uh, there's a, a piece here and a piece here, and you push it. And this thing comes right out. Once it comes out, it's a little easier to take it apart. Um, this is the sensor side or the seat side, and this is the um, the car side. Usually, they come apart by pulling them. Um, if they don't, we're going to have to use a little screwdriver or something. I'm going to pause it again. So I got the, the the seat side sensor just so you could take a closer look at it. It's um, let's see, it's this end. So once we pull it out of that assembly, um, what we're taking apart is not up here, it's down here. So it's this part slipping inside here. So it goes in like that. So what we want to do is, is get this and pull this out. Sometimes they, there's a little uh, a bump there, and I don't know how to do it except to get a little tiny screwdriver, which I'm going to get now. So often these come apart very easily, but sometimes they don't, and when I don't, um, I'm not sure how else to do this. I don't see a really easy way to do it, so I try to lift this up. without breaking it, if possible. It's a really small screwdriver, and it comes right apart. You see that? So the problem is that this uh, this rail in here uh, gets caught in this hole in, in, the, in the, the receiving side. So they're stuck in there like this. There's a little divot. I think, yeah, there's a little divot right there. That divot is what catches it right there. So when I put my screwdriver in here, I'm just lifting it up a little to release this hole from holding this little divot. I hope that helps.